hurt and you can't let go It's not your fault and you don't deserve All the bad and the hurt I know you tried so hard Ooh, I know you've done your part It's not fair Good morning, you guys. It is Friday, November 30th. Last day of November. Yeah, so a lot of my Vlogmas, the first ones were like pre-filmed. Well, like two of them. Just because I know that me vlogging on the weekends isn't always a thing so i just took a shower it's like 10 30. um this morning i was just on my computer doing some youtube and school stuff not really doing any homework just kind of like doing some stuff nothing really important took a shower because my hair really needed to be washed and i might be like going out to lunch i say like so much and then I might be going out to lunch with Cory and Martina and Martina's daughter, Sophia, but I'm not entirely sure about that. So we'll see, but I guess I'll do some homework now that I've showered, cleaned up a little bit. There's nothing left to do to procrastinate. Right here is like so swollen from my root canal and it actually like really hurts. I'm trying to fix that, but I don't really see that happening. How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up Just hold on tight It'll be I'm just about to get ready. I'm going out to lunch with Corey Martina and Sophia as I said earlier. I edited the vlog that will go up on Sunday. I haven't finished it. I still have to add like music. Oh god, this is a good question. You guys always ask me what music I use. I think I think that's my number one asked question. I get my music from a copyright free website that you have to pay for. So essentially you pay $15 a month and now you have the license to that music so I can still make money on my videos without being copyrighted because I technically hold like a license to use that music. A lot of this music isn't available on YouTube and Spotify, but the only band on there that I use a lot that I know is, is called Loving Caliber, and I use a lot of their music. You can Google or YouTube search it, but everyone else is mainly just copyright free stuff. So that's why I don't really ever answer those questions, because unless you're going to pay $15 a month, then there's like, you can't really find it, as far as I know. It's not like, I don't know. It's just for people who are like creating commercials or YouTube videos, stuff like that. But I'm going to get ready now. Um, I guess I'll include a little get ready with me since I haven't really done anything else today. So. All your life you've tried to be a good man inside. Did everything that you thought you should Didn't seem to do you any good Okay, so my makeup tip of the video 
is if you put your foundation on and you know how sometimes like it just doesn't look right it's like sitting in your pores it's kind of separating sometimes it happens to me and I don't know why because like I haven't done anything different to my skin but sometimes it happens so what I do is I spray my face with my Too Faced spray let it completely dry and then I go in with a powder foundation and my favorite powder foundation of all time is the IT Cosmetics one and I just take a flathead kabuki brush and just go over the areas that it's all messed up which is usually like right here for me I don't know why it's very strange but I go over those parts and then you're pretty much good I feel like the powder just kind of sits on top of whatever issue you're having and you can just go in with like a damp sponge after if your face feels kind of dry and I'm adding more eyeshadow because it just wasn't doing it for me I'm obsessed with this Tuscany shade from the artistry palette from bad habit like if I don't wear it every single day I feel like my makeup looks so bad I just love it it's the perfect brown whoa my hair I decided to not curl it just because I didn't feel like it and I also changed my outfit because I just felt like wearing black today I'm in a black outfit kind of mood done getting ready I'm actually I'll show you my outfit and then I'm gonna go to the bathroom and then I'm gonna leave I just posted a picture on Instagram of my outfit so if you don't follow me there you should but I'm wearing this sweater from H&M my new American Eagle jeans which okay guys maybe I was feeling a little ambitious when I ordered a size 6 because these are super tight like oh my god they're like suffocating me almost but I'm gonna wear them anyways but they look much better because they're not super loose, you know? But American Eagle jeans, and these are my new Lord & Taylor boots, which I will have linked below. They're so cute. They have a little heel, and I just think they're very cute. And they're prof not, like, professional looking, but they're not, like, they don't look like clubbing shoes, if you will. You know how some boots kind of look like nighttime boots? These are more, like, daytime appropriate. And then I'm wearing this little... Y necklace from Forever 21, Michael Kors bracelet, I mean Michael Kors watch, and Alex Anani bracelet. And that is my look. Alright, this is my outfit now that I'm leaving. It's snowing out, so I figured now is the best time to wear this bray that I bought in like August. I don't think I'm wearing it correctly, but I saw on Negan Mishrali's Instagram she wore it like this, and I love her style, so... I thought I'll wear it like this too and I'm wearing my express scarf and my express coat and then I showed you my other outfit like my actual outfit but it's like freezing out so I'm gonna wear all this outer wear so I'm gonna go and I'll see you later well I'm all for Christmas all the happy smiles and the wishes and I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe Tell me one thing Is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you... Hey guys, it's the next day now. It's Saturday morning. It's like 9 o'clock. I just got Starbucks. I got chestnut praline latte because now I really like them and now I'm addicted. Today I'm going to practice my oral argument, like actually speaking it, because I realized last night when I was at Martina's, I was like, I've only ever practiced my argument twice, and then the other argument I have to do, I haven't practiced at all. So, <laughs> I kind of have to do that today, and I have to go to like Target or Express or New York and Company, something like that, to get a pair of slacks that are long and that's it so I'm just gonna do a lot of practicing today but first I have to wake up because I'm still tired but I just made my first vlogmas video live which is very exciting and uh yeah so I'll update you guys later whatever we do we will be all right these holiday wonders will open your mind May all your wishes tonight come true. Because this vlog sucked and I didn't do anything, 
we're going to do a Jesse Q&A because you always want to know more about Jesse and Jesse's also going to answer questions about me and we'll see how well he knows me. And I only agree to do it if Ow, I sit on her lap. you're pulling my hair. Why are we going through your Instagram? Because that's where people ask me questions. How do, how do they do that? How do you even get to this? Oh, just answer the questions. Okay. Okay. What's one of my biggest pet peeves? One of your biggest pet peeves? Yeah. I mean, there's just, it's anything that I do. I Ow, Jesse. <laughs> Can you get your chair? Okay, fine. Okay, whatever. He's not answering. One of your biggest pet peeves is when I make a mess and I just leave it out there. And... Yes. How would you make my day? <sighs> if I proposed to you, that would probably make your day. Yeah, that would. Who is my favorite YouTuber? Can you look at the camera? Lipstick and lattes. Can... Your favorite YouTuber? Mm. I don't. Oh, uh, David. <gasps> David. Um. You guys know who I David mean. Dobrik is yes. one of them, yeah, yeah, sure. What is my favorite Starbucks order? Your favorite Starbucks order? Like my go-to Starbucks order. I feel like it's the the white chocolate mocha. No? Dude, I like never get that. <laughs> <laughs> Toffee nut white mocha. No. That's my favorite. I figure that's your favorite Skinny too. Skinny iced caramel macchiato. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. You know what? I switch it up all the time, so that's you a hard do. question. How do you stay in such great shape with such a busy work schedule? They want to know. Me or you? You. Me? <laughs> genetics. Yeah, it's all genetics. You I eat like crap. Some days I eat breakfast, some days I don't. When I do eat breakfast, is usually. We don't need to go through everything you eat. It's usually double egg, bacon, cheese, salt, pepper, ketchup. Okay. So it's just genetics. Cause Every it's like meal deserves a dessert. That's my motto. Who was the first one to make a move when we started dating? Me. Jesse, yeah. I wanted nothing to do with him. Multiple, multiple moves. Yeah. We were just talking about that today. Yeah. We only started going out again because I kept, I kept asking her to go out on a date and she kept saying no. And then we just so happened to see each other in the movie theater. And of course, I was wearing... Ugly As you call pants. them, god awful sweatpants. Mm -hmm. How do you deal with me needing to study all the time? I just don't enter the room, and when I do enter the room, it's for seconds just to annoy her. What is your occupation? Investor. He owns an HVAC <laughs> business, so don't listen to him. Um, could you pick out an outfit for me, head to toe? in my fashion sense yes what would it be what for what it depends where you're going too like going out with cory martina going out with cory martina or oh, just the jeans that you always wear black jeans yeah your, your favorite pair of black jeans and then some shirt that ends about right here somewhere and that's it that's I, all you need my shoes oh the 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 boots and what if I was just going to class? Your your business suit. <laughs> okay, next question. <laughs> it's, a, it's a suit. I wear jeans and like boots. You wore you wore like jeans at the, the, yeah, the black jacket. Yeah, that's because I had an argument that day. Oh, I don't. Well, what's I'm one sure thing I, I can't that. live without? Yeah, my phone <laughs> definitely. When are you gonna put a ring on it? One day. Just kidding. What's your favorite quality about me? And be serious. Your sass. What's your favorite quality? Your sass. Why is that your favorite quality? I don't know. It just is. Your sass. If I was stranded on an island, what would be three things I couldn't live without? Um. Well, your phone. It just doesn't need food or water. I need just, water. All right, phone, a cell tower, and water. Yeah, that's there all I go. need to survive. Oh, um, I would use the cell tower, maybe solar panels, power sunscreen, up the phone. maybe. What's my favorite show? Of current, what the man in the high castle? Yeah. Are you ready to be married to a lawyer and therefore lose every argument you'll ever have? I already lose every argument that we that I ever have. How long do I need in the morning to get ready? Two minutes. True. Am I a mountain or a beach girl? 
certainly not a mountain girl. <laughs> I wish we had videos from the day we went hiking with Corey. We could just insert those here. Which celebrity would I love to meet the most? Who would it be? Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig? I love him. And for a girl? Uh, Ryan Reynolds' wife? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what her name is. Blake, Blake Lively. Yeah, I suppose. She'll do. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching our Q&A. <laughs> Peach move. I have to end the vlog. That would be Thank a good you one. guys for watching this q and A. I I hope you found it very informative. And, um... I hope you learned so much about me today. Um... And a little bit about Grace. Yeah. But mostly me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this Q&A. Now you can go back to your work. He did not want to do this so bad. I had to force him. I just... See, that this is my thing. I hate getting into things, but once I'm in, I just kind of... No, you I'll just want to talk all day. Yeah, so you have created this monster. Talk until the camera dies. No. <laughs> it's coming no. with me. <laughs> Peach. Your paws like screen on the floor. So I'm finally leaving the house today, guys. It's 7 40. We're gonna go to Home Sense and Home Depot. Uh, because I need to see the outside world. And I just felt like going there. We're here. We did it. The love I live, the dream I know. It's Christmas, I only want to be close to you our night at the worst place on earth, Home Depot. Okay, we're leaving Home Depot. Oops. We just had to get pellets for uh, the pellet stove upstairs. Going home now. I have to go to bed because I have to get up early tomorrow morning for my argument. I basically didn't do anything today, so. Whoopsie. I just, like, didn't do anything. Seriously, I didn't do anything today. Uh, which is my usual Saturday. I don't really do anything. So I'm going to go home and just get ready for bed and go to sleep. I didn't eat dinner or breakfast today. I just didn't really eat a lot. So I'm kind of hungry right now. But I don't know. If I should even get something since it's like so late. It's so late. It's 9 o'clock. That's it. I'll update you if I do anything else. If not, I'll see you before I go to we bed. We just got home. We went to the freaking diner and I had chicken fingers. And now I feel like a fat piece of... And my stomach hurts. So that's just my life. Did but, you just said to yourself? Yeah. Wow. But I got these shoes... Uh, I went with these ones because I thought the heel was just like the perfect amount and I always just feel better in heels you know flats kind of make me feel a little a little weird sometimes and they're by the brand Essex Lane and they were $60 but I had a $10 off so they were $50 and I'll link them below they're really comfortable and they're just like perfect for like a professional shoe because they're black pointed toe low heel and it's a block heel so you won't be all wobbly, wobbly. And then I got you guys a thing for the giveaway, but I wanted to show you the box that it's going to come in. Isn't this the cutest box ever? It's like golden sparkly pink Christmas trees. I want to like put it on display. This is going to go with the other giveaway stuff. But now I'm going to get in bed. I have to edit a thumbnail for tomorrow's video. And then I'm going to go to sleep because I have to get up really early to get ready and get to school. Jesse is doing construction in the closet, which is more than annoying.
Peach is his lovely assistant. But that is all for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed all this lovely content we got today. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe if you aren't. I'll see you again in the next one. Peace out. Jesse's doing it over there. You can't see. Peace out. I don't know what you've been told, but this guy right here is gonna rule the world.